Hi everyone, it's Miss B. Today I'm gonna show you how to add and subtract fractions on using butterfly method. So what you can see here is actually student work. So um, um, person student was adding and subtracting some fra um, fractions. So and um, there's a beautiful butterfly here and there's another one here so it's beautiful work so now on the next um page so i'm gonna use few examples to show you how to add and subtract fractions using this method so just to remind us when we do have fraction we have a number above the line so here's the line so this is the line there's a number above the line it's number two and there's a number below the line in this case is number three the number below line it's called numerator and the one below it's called denominator so when we do have fractions so it's pretty easy or straightforward to add them or take away if we do have the same denominator when you do have the same denominator all we have to do is pretty much is just you know copying down denominator is the same and then adding whatever numbers or taking away depends on the operation you have um adding the numbers above the line one plus seven is eight and eight over three so the next one that we have here is subtraction again same we do have the same denominator as we said before easy we do copy denominator which is five in this case and the numbers above the line, in this case, is number 7. So it's going to be 7. And then the sign or operation that we have here, it's take away. So take away 4 and simplify. 7 take away 4 is 3. So And that would be it for this one here. Now, however, when we do have different... Um, denominators sometimes um, students get a little bit confused sometimes not all the time so I'm gonna try today to use butterfly method and maybe that's gonna simplify for some students maybe not but um I do like it it's creative it does look nice if yeah so let's first create butterflies so I'm gonna use some um, yellow color so and the next step it would be to like sort of you know yeah connect those two numbers and then i'm gonna do same with one and five just like that so um and the next thing i'm gonna do is i'm gonna add here a few lines which i don't know what they called it's just like that so the next step you know um it will be to look at the numbers that we connected first which is um in this case is four and two so 4 times 2 is, I'm going to use 8, oh, right. it's 8. And now doing the same with the others, which in this case is 5 and 1. And 5 times 1 is equal to 5. So we're going to have 5 here. Now the next step, it will be, I'm going to draw one more line here, which is there, like, like this. Which means that we do have to have sort of connection between numbers 5 and 2. So we're going to multiply 5 and 2. That is going to give us 5 times 2 is 10. I'm going to use here that as well, 10. Now, the next step is to have a line here. Copy this 10 in denominator, just write it in denominator. And add the numbers above the line in this case eight and five so that's going to be eight plus five and that is going to be equal to 13 over 10 and that would be it um let's try another one which is the next one here let's um be consistent with colors and connect those two numbers two and four and then connect five and three and we're just drawing butterfly it does look like butterfly not as beautiful as the one before on the previous page but yeah sort of it does look like butterfly 
Um, now, the same thing what we're going to do is, let's use red, multiplying, multiplying 2 and 4, that's going to be 8. Now, multiplying 3 and 5, it will be 15. And as well as multiplying 3 and 4, and that is going to be 12. Next step, this part here, this 12, is going to go in denominator, which is there. And the other two numbers that we have above the line, which is 8 and 15, so we're going to add them together. So we're going to do 8 plus 15, and it's equal to 23 over 12. And yeah, that's that one. And let's do one more where we do have subtraction. It's pretty much similar to um, addition. So only when we have, you know, a plus thing, instead of plus, we're going to use take away. Again, I'm going to use yellow, connecting these lines and trying to draw beautiful yellow butterfly. So like that yep so and then let's go with red same as before 8 times multiplying those numbers 8 times 5 it's gonna give us 40 so the next one 9 times 3 9 times 3 that is gonna give us 27 and the last step it's 9 times 5 it will give us 45 and this is going to be equal to 45 it's going to go in denominator and the numbers above the line 40 and 27 so um i almost said add but it's not adding we do have take away here so that would be 40 and now take away Take away 27, and that is going to give us what? 45, and here's 30. And that would be all for now. Okay, I hope you enjoyed it, and um, you love my butterflies. Bye!